Get ready for an unforgettable journey through the heart of the Big Apple. Welcome to our guide to the best things to do in New York, where we'll explore iconic landmarks, hidden gems, and incredible experiences that will make your NYC visit truly exceptional. Our first stop takes us to one of the most iconic symbols of freedom and democracy, the Statue of Liberty. This colossal copper sculpture, gifted to the United States by France, has stood proudly in New York Harbor since 1886. Did you know that Lady Liberty's full name is Liberty Enlightening the World? It's a breathtaking sight to behold, and you can even climb to the crown for a mesmerizing view of the city and the harbor. As we move on, we find ourselves in the heart of Manhattan, Central Park. This sprawling oasis in the midst of the urban jungle spans 843 acres and offers a serene escape from the city's hustle and bustle. Have you ever wondered how Central Park came to be? It was designed by Frederick Law Olmsted and Calvert Vox in the 19th century, making it one of the most visited urban parks in the world. Share your favorite Central Park memory or activity in the comments below. Before we continue our exploration, I'd love to hear from you. What's your favorite way to experience Central Park? A leisurely stroll, a picnic by the lake, or perhaps a horse-drawn carriage ride? Share your preferred Central Park activity with us, and let's celebrate the park's diversity. Our next destination is a vibrant crossroads of entertainment and culture, Times Square. This dazzling commercial and entertainment hub is famous for its electrifying billboards and the iconic New Year's Eve ball drop. But did you know that the first New Year's Eve ball drop in Times Square took place in 1907? Imagine the excitement of welcoming the new year amidst the bright lights in the cheering crowd. As we continue our journey, we enter the hallowed halls of the Metropolitan Museum of Art, often referred to as the Met. This renowned museum houses an incredible collection spanning over 5,000 years of art from around the world. It's not just a museum, it's a journey through human creativity and history. Have you ever explored the Met's vast galleries? While we're on the topic of art, I'm curious about your favorite art form or artistic period. Share your artistic preferences with us in the comments, and let's appreciate the beauty of creativity together. The lights, the drama, the magic. Welcome to Broadway. New York's theater district is the epicenter of world-class theater productions. Did you know that the longest-running Broadway show is The Phantom of the Opera? It's been captivating audiences since 1988. What's your favorite Broadway musical or play, and why? As we reach for new heights, we find ourselves atop the iconic Empire State Building. This Art Deco masterpiece has graced the New York skyline since 1931. It's not just a skyscraper, it's a symbol of ambition and innovation. Have you ever marveled at the breathtaking views from its observation deck? Before we ascend to our next adventure, let's talk about heights. Are you an adrenaline junkie who loves tall buildings? Or do you prefer keeping your feet firmly on the ground? Share your thoughts on heights and skyscrapers in the comments. Our journey continues with a stroll across the majestic Brooklyn Bridge. This engineering marvel, completed in 1883, connects Manhattan and Brooklyn. It's not just a bridge, it's a testament to human ingenuity. Have you ever walked or biked across this iconic suspension bridge? As we immerse ourselves in the world of art, we arrive at the Museum of Modern Art, also known as MoMA. This institution showcases a diverse collection of modern and contemporary art, including works by iconic artists like Pablo Picasso and Vincent van Gogh. Did you know that MoMA's collection includes over 200,000 works of art? It's a treasure trove of creativity. While we're in the realm of modern art, I'd love to hear about your favorite modern artists or art movements. Share your artistic passions with us in the comments, and let's celebrate the world of contemporary creativity. Our journey takes a somber yet important turn as we pay our respects at the 9-11 Memorial and Museum. This memorial honors the victims of the September 11, 2001 terrorist attacks. Visiting this site is a powerful reminder of resilience and unity. Have you ever visited the 9-11 Memorial and Museum, and what were your thoughts and emotions? And now for a 10-op moment. Pick something to drink and relax. We have selected the most beautiful videos and interesting content for you. Have fun and see you after the 10-top moment.
And then now the last one we wrap up our New York adventure with a visit to the iconic Coney Island. This historic amusement destination has been captivating visitors for over a century. It's not just an amusement park, it's a timeless escape filled with nostalgia and thrills. What's your favorite memory from Coney Island or your favorite ride at Luna Park? Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey through the best things to do in New York. If you enjoyed this exploration, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your New York stories in the comments below. Until next time, happy travels!